better to meet a man in a bar because you know how much he drinks than to meet him in church and have no idea. Sure, but, but <laughs> Okay, ladies, the million dollar question. Where should women go to meet great men? I love this question because women come to me as a dating coach and they say, you know, I don't need any coaching, but can you just tell me where I can find the good men? As if there's some big neon sign aiming at some bar where all the six feet tall um, guys who are really handsome and make $250,000 hang out, right? They all in yeah, one place, exactly, right? Yeah. And I have to tell Wall them Street. the truth, right? <laughs> Wall Street, right. I have to tell them the truth that, you know, Actually, good men are mixed in with all the other guys. <laughs> and that's the purpose of dating, is to meet men and weed through and find somebody you're compatible with and somebody that you like. It's not where you go, but who are you when you're meeting these men? You know, are you open? Are you friendly? Are you approachable? Are you happy? Well, AARP did a survey, and maybe it was like five years ago, of women 40 to 70 and asking them about their habits. And what they discover for these single women is that only 16% actually want to do anything about changing their status. Wow. I know. So when women tell me about all the competition out there, I'm like, only 16% actually want to do anything. So get <laughs> out right. there and get busy. Yeah. That's good. That's okay. So you can meet men anywhere. They're yeah, all absolutely. over the place. There's no neon sign for good men, right? And That's it's about right. your mindset and being open and available. Sure and it's about picking men that are smart choices yes. that are actually available. Yes. And then the world's your oyster. That's right. Exactly. That's right.